Welcome, my friends. Welcome back to the next episode of Enviroboy Plays Resident Evil 2. Uh, it, we're... It's been, well, like, a week or two since I've recorded this game. Hi! Oh, that's right, I forgot we were with her. Okay. That's right, okay, and we then we, we dealt with the Florida Sewer Gator. Um, okay, it's all coming back to me. All coming back to me. Um, where are we on... Okay, yeah, and we had to save... Point, which I was happy about. And now we're gonna continue through here. Cool. Definitely William's handiwork. Identify yourself. Annette Birkin. No, 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 no. She's supposed to identify herself. You don't identify her. Not what I said. Need to dispose of it. We're here for the G virus. Yeah. That's not gonna happen. I'm warning you, Doctor. Oh yeah. Hey. Good lord. <laughs> what a what a train wreck of a situation. <laughs> Didn't expect that from a scientist. Uh, Literally dying down here. Forget about me. Just go. Oh my gosh, are we gonna switch players? We're we gonna switch characters? Are we are we gonna be What's happening? Oh, okay, now we got a different outfit. Okay, we naturally needed an outfit change. Now that we're gonna, like, actually be, uh, Ada here, we need to be in something much more needlessly sex appeal related. <laughs> what kind of impractical outfit is that? <laughs> this is insane. Why, why is there, like, a little decorative bow on it? What is happening? Oh, my Lanta. Okay, so do we... Wow, we don't get any of our crap? Oh, man. To be honest, I'm kind of disappointed by this. Is he supposedly dead or just, like, wounded? I'm assuming he's just, like, wounded and unconscious through it all, but... I don't know. This thing just got really weird, man. I don't understand. I don't know what to expect from this. What's going on here? What am I witnessing? Alright, well, anyway. Okay, so... <laughs> what? What is happening? What on earth is possibly going on right now? Okay, so we have... Looks like probably... A way to go up. Come on, okay, and then there's... Up. Oh, look at her go, running in heels, though. You know what? Good for her. And we can't interact with that. Okay. And, yeah, there's nothing for us to do with this guy. I just, I'm, the reason I'm pacing around right now is because I'm trying to figure out why this is red. What, what thing am I missing? To, like, pick up or whatever. Maybe nothing right now? What is that? Is that, oh, it's a bottle. I was gonna say, is that just, like, a, an arm laying there, or? I don't know. I don't have any possible idea what's going on right now. I mean, like, story-wise, I get it, but, like, in terms of just the decisions made about what game we're playing now. Oh, okay, we just had this. All right. Need my visualizer to track wiring and hack electronic equipment. Wow, that's, um, outrageously sci-fi. Um, oh, okay. You've just been hacked. Yeah. I'm in. Okay, wait, hold on. Can I... Are there other things to hack and track here? Nope. Apparently not. Okay. What a bizarre turn this this book right now. I don't know. Okay, wait. So what did that achieve for me? Oh, I see. Are we going to hack it and break it? Okay. That was safe and necessary. Okay. From a baby. <laughs> yeah, this movie went like hardcore fifth element on us here. Now, this is weird. Um, I just, I'm, I'm so lost for words about what's going on. Oh, do we need to do it, do the whole... 
Oh, I see. Okay, so we gotta get that first. And now we're gonna do this, and I'm sure this is gonna be perfectly safe and fine, and no shrapnel will possibly hit us when we make this thing helicopter its way to oblivion. See? What did I tell you? Everything's fine. Um, oh. Okay, well... Kind of disappointed that we have to play without all of our goodies that we got as, as, as our, as our friend Leo there. I miss Himbo Leo, to be honest. Uh, September inspection, week one. I already put in a request last week, but we absolutely must have a replacement ID wristband ASAP. We need one to gain access to certain areas in the main facility. In other words, me and my crew can't get to the places we need to in order to do our job right now. So I don't want to hear anyone accusing us of slacking off. Okay, so like just context clues, we need a wristband, but we kind of learned that from the other playthrough, didn't we? All right. So, okay, so I, I will say though, now that we're playing a completely different character and everything, I am glad that I'm sitting here doing a second run through. I don't know if I'll end up doing our, um, like, you know, the whole new game plus, uh, you know, sticker spiel or whatever. Um, like, I don't know that, I don't know that I'll bother with that, but, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see. Okay, and I'll probably want to pull this back out. But yeah, like, if, if things are going to be this wildly different, then, okay, yeah, I'm into it. I'm into it. Like, I don't understand what's happening, but I'm into the fact that unique things are happening. So, I say, there's, the, there's, there's strange decisions made. Just in terms with like the the direction and design of of the game and everything, you know, like why am I walking around in a in a night, you know, in a night on the town, paint the town red dress right now, um, you know that it's just it, it's a weird decision. It was it was a weird choice, um, design wise. I mean, like I I understand why they did the choice, um, you know, because, uh, because. Uh, boobies sell things to men. So, like, I'm sure that's where the decision largely came from. But, I mean, just so outrageously out of left field, you know? And, and it might be a product of the time, because when was this game? Like, late 90s, early 2000s? I don't remember exactly when this game was originally. We're playing the remake, right? So it's naturally 20 years later or whatever it is things are probably going to be a little different in terms of you know how they land for an audience and i feel like we're kind of a victim of that right now um so you know it's fine we can maybe offer a little bit of slack or leeway for that reason but how many times are we gonna have to do this we good are we done okay there's a lot of ammo Sometimes it feels like there isn't any sort of actual health bar metric and just kind of more of a, like, you know, RNG, this bullet has this percentage of a chance of killing the creature. And you just kind of keep rolling the dice every time you, sh you shoot him. It's weird, but hey, you know, it's fine. I got a Joker vibe going in there. I don't know how I got these scars. I was running around downtown and this guy came up and bit me. And he turned me into a zombie. Oh, that's an incredibly expected story, since you're, like, a zombie. Alright, yeah. Uh, those for sure. This uh, grenade that I'm not actually super stoked to have. I have to imagine that we're going to go back to being uh, uh, Leon at some point. You know, like, I, I have to imagine that they're going to give us that. Rather than it just going to be sort of this continuous... You know, the, this this weird shuffle of now, you know, oh, you spent all this time upgrading Leon, and now you don't get to be a Leon anymore. You know, like, it, it has to... That's that's what I'm guessing is going to happen at some point here. Um, but hey, I could be wrong, because if I had put, you know, oh, we're going to play an entirely different character on my bingo sheet of what would happen... Uh, in this playthrough as Leon, I wouldn't have I wouldn't have put this here. Kind of amazing to me, actually. I'm sitting here thinking to myself, it's kind of amazing that I've managed to avoid the spoilers and 
like didn't know that that type of stuff would happen because i've never played all of the resident evil games you know the only ones i've really played are the most recent ones like seven and eight and even eight i haven't played all the way through it it just kind of got me thinking like you know i should play all of them because they're all like widely beloved games by people for the most part i mean i'm sure there's plenty of people that are angry and don't like it would it not work okay Okay. So yeah, no, it's it's impressive to me that I've managed to avoid spoilers, and I'm actually kind of happy for it because I get to enjoy these little surprises, like oh hey, we're an entirely different character now, even if the transition is strange. Like, I'm gonna I'm gonna assume that maybe we're gonna learn some backstory that she was operating undercover as a uh, lady of the night or something like that, and then you know things happen, and oh here we are. Okay, so we're we're dealing with him now, huh? Wait, why isn't this? Oh, probably because I need to like. Uh. Oh, okay then. Excuse me. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> I, um. Oh no, I don't think that's what we want. Well, let's just kind of go through here then. Okay, so like clearly I need to divert power to that from somewhere. Question is, where is that somewhere? Alright, well, can we... Can I not go back down? That's dumb. Ow, bro. Rude. Okay, well, you know... I maintain that this isn't my fault. This game is not being clear about what's happening. This is kind of one of the problems of... The fact that I'm on, like, you know, I've, I've done a couple playthroughs of this or something. Uh, is this guy doesn't actually feel all that scary and intimidating to me now, which I think he's supposed to. Oh, there we go. That's where it is. It was there all along. Oh, wait, no. And then we can just... Oh, well, you know what. Are we, are we done? Is that it? Or are we good? Are we still alive? Oh, we're still good. No, we're good. Uh, yeah, we'll grab those. Why not? <laughs> this is absurd. So, like... Okay, um... Are we doing the whole... fan thing again? Looks like it. Oops, 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 oops. Oh, oops, that's not what I meant to press. Where is he? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Okay. I think I need to get that going. Come on, faster. Ah! Whoops. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> this isn't going exceptionally well. I wonder if I can just, like, kind of keep moving and buy myself a little extra time here. Can we go through? Can we go through? Oh, no. Okay. Wait. Oh, we're still alive, though. We're still alive. We're good. We're good. This is fine. Everything's fine. Where is he? Oh, you're going to stay over there? Okay. Well, then, yeah. You just come over this way. Perfect. Flawless execution. I don't understand, though. Can't he just, like... Isn't he strong enough to just kind of bust his way through there or something? Whatever. It's fine. This is normal. <laughs> okay. So gonna, oh, hey. Well, you know what? We'll go ahead and give ourselves a save. Is it gonna... Oh, I want to see. Is it still showing as, like, Leon if we go in there? Yeah, it still shows it as, as Leon. Um, which is strange, but it's fine. Okay, so wait, let me guess. We need to do something with this. Oh man, they're gonna really like make this one a puzzle situation, aren't they? Do we not get any sort of health buffs um, as when we're going through as Ada? Because if the answer is no, then it's just gonna make me particularly glad that I decided to play on assisted mode um because like I, I you know i'm not afraid of challenges i've played and beaten many difficult games before um and they all have their there's some there is something fun and satisfying about it but in general i i have to be in the right mood for a challenge and for the most part i like to just play games as you know being the 
unadulterated god that can just kind of go through and and bullhead, you know, bull rush his way through everything and does not really have to worry about much in the way of consequences for bad decisions and stuff like that. So it makes video games fun for me. So I don't I don't mind the fact that we're on assisted mode where we just kind of automatically get back a certain amount of health. I'm cool with that. Anyway, with a new wristband that's just arrived, we can finally begin our survey of the demolition area. As to the report from the other day about the incinerator, it's nothing really. Probably just a large piece of leftover trash. I'll go take a look myself as I wrap up this report. Uh oh. Oh no, that's where it all began. Anyway. Have to be very ginger when you get the thing going. Okay, so. And we got some power going. Oh man, oh, do we have to like walk in the incinerator or something? Is that hitting at? Oh, this seems ill advised. This seems like a miraculously bad idea. All right. Just being safe. Watch him come to life now. Yeah, go ahead and put that in your inventory. Oh yeah, there we go. That's outrageously amazing. Okay. Um. I guess we're supposed to. You'll never get your filthy hands on the G. The G. Never get it on the G. The OG. Okay. Okay, so I understand conceptually probably what I'm supposed to do here. I don't think that's usually how incinerators work, but that's fine. Okay, so if we go then up there and follow this, like I don't know exactly what this is looking for for me. Do I Oh, I wonder if I have to do them one at a time. Got it. Okay, I got it. I understand now. Hopefully I didn't just absolutely destroy myself by taking too long doing it the wrong way, but I get it now. And then we want to come over to this one, divert from there, and so that way we can get this. Yeah, this isn't really how incinerators work, but it's cool. That bitch knows what she's doing. Does she though? I don't know. <laughs> it's interesting to me the way that they've made the character um, what's her face, you know, that we're kind of squaring off with right now. It's interesting to me the way they've kind of made her different in this playthrough than when we were playing as Claire. Um, okay, where are we? We're here now. Okay. Yeah. How are we doing on our health? Oh yeah, we're still at the caution. Yeah, so we've gained a little bit of health back, but I think there's a cap to how much you get to have back. Um, which is, you know, fair, fair enough. I'm already playing on the, like, quote-unquote assisted, which is kind of just like the cheater's mode. So, oh, cool. Yeah, she's a very different character from this perspective than from the Claire perspective. And what I'm curious about is if that's, like, supposed to be... Like, she's acting in different ways against different people, or if we're just encountering her at different stages in this whole thing. I'm not perfectly sure what it is. Someone's dead body. Whee! Long live the king. Oh, this is fine. Now we're going to have to be Leon, like, and find her to help her or something. No, don't pull it out. That's always a bad decision. Always leave it in. <laughs> I don't know. We've become quite cozy towards him, though, out of nowhere. So she, like... Okay, so she's just unconscious or whatever. And now we're going to be Leon. And we're going to bounce between the two. And now he's going to magically be fine, right? Ugh. I'm, in, I, I'm living life in assisted mode. 
which means that after a certain amount of time, my gunshot wounds will close themselves and I'll be fine. As you can see, the bandages expedited the process, but my natural healing abilities have largely made me okay. Ada? Damn it. Watch your language. Okay, so do I get all my crap back now? Heck yeah. Alright, um... Okay, where are we on the map now? We're here. Alright, are we gonna have to just like follow her footsteps through everything? I'm gonna be kind of annoyed if it... Ada, where do are that. You? Maybe... Go, can, oh, we see we can use this with him now. That's what I want to do. Oh yeah, now we're at the incinerator. Okay, yeah, this is a much faster approach to things. <laughs> Although, I guess we're not in the exact same spot by the looks of it. I and Actually, you know what? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's not the incinerator. It looks like the incinerator, but I actually don't think it is. Um, am I supposed to just jump down into the sewer water? Yup. Okay. Well, down we go. Come on. Okay. Um, let's see here. Uh, oh, shoot. Hold on. I have to pause for just a hot sickety second here. Okay, we're back. Sorry. That was to deal with coordinating things this later this week i am uh i i i have so i don't know anyone who hasn't heard me mention it before i am a kickboxing uh coach in in my free time among other things in my free time but that's one of the things i do with my free time and we have a tournament this week uh later this week that we have a few of our guys competing in so just coordinating things and have to be ready to handle all that stuff as it pops up. Oh, shoot. I missed something back there. Gosh dang it. Thank thankfully, the map told me about it. On earth? Are bullets back here? Are they sitting on the trash pile or something? Oh, they're sitting on the trash pile. Okay. Me being red, green, colorblind, making reds and greens all look largely brown, sitting on a brown pile of crap there. I, I maintain that it's not my fault that I missed that. <laughs> That's... That's, I, I feel like that's an acceptable thing, and I'm fine with the fact that the uh, the map had to save me on that one. Not my fault. Not my fault that I'm blind, just my curse. Okay, um, okay so we... Oh, I didn't mean to do an about face, my bad. So if we go down here, it looks like this will lead to a dead end. Um, okay then. And then, but we also have some goodies. That, oh, those are different. Yeah, let's just shotgun and shells. Let's just put those there. I definitely will need to do inventory management. We'll do that later. Who was hissing at me? Apparently no one. Okay, it's fine. That's fine, whatever. You know, sometimes you're just wandering around and you just hear random hissing noises. It, it happens. I'll just be glad it's not the hissing of a sewer gator, am I right? You don't get up there, armored man. Armored men. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, we'll go ahead and put that there. And Oh, yeah, I hear you now. Hi. All right, how many bullets are you going to take? Yeah, I was going to say, I was like, I don't know. I don't know that I trust that you're done. Let's see. Are you done now? Are you done for real? Okay, I think we're good. I think we're Gucci. As long as the armored guys don't stand up again, then we're fine. I'm trying to trying to make sense of where where I'm at in the map with like the sewers and stuff, um, because we definitely were in the sewers during the Claire run through, but it was a little bit ago that I played that, and also we're approaching it from different angles and everything. So trying to make sense of it is like, okay, wait, hold on, where are we? I wonder if we're gonna have to play with the chest pieces. Yeah. Knew I couldn't trust you. Never trust a dead body, okay? Hi. Oh, that was a wasted bullet. I hate wasting bullets. Okay, like, are you... Okay, you seem to be dead dead. I don't think you're usually... Oh, wow, okay, yep, yeah, now he's dead dead. 
Usually when they fall on their backs, they're not quite dead dead, you know what I mean? So I wasn't quite sure what to expect there. Um, okay, so we have a doorway here. Can't go through it, that's fine. There's that s those stairs to go down. I don't want to do that quite yet. Oh, you know what? I do recognize this area. I know exactly where we are right now. Um, can't go through there. Who's, who's getting up? You're getting up, okay. All over the railing. Dang it. He has assumed the position, but I will not take advantage of that because A, never take advantage of anyone, and B, you. Alright, I think you're dead. I'm gonna trust it. Take this. We are playing with chess pieces a little bit. Oh, okay, there he goes. Oh, I might need to put this back in place so I can go through those steps because I think that's the only place I can go. Yeah, that's the only place I can go. All the other doors are locked. So, okay, put it put it back. Put it back, put it back, put it back. Like, all these doors? Yeah, all these doors are locked. It's got them marked as locked, too. That's helpful. Oh, oh, he's jiggling. <laughs> okay. Um, let's see here. Okay, what do we got here? Is that just... An, do I want to pick that up right now? I don't know if it's going to be wise to pick that up, but I guess I will. Um, let's see here. Wait, whoops, hold on a second. One more, I, more coordination, one second. Alright, I'm back. <laughs> Which is like, it's almost silly for me to point it out because you would never know, like, because I just paused the recording and everything, so... But, you know, I just, I like transparency, okay? I want to be honest with all of you. You're doing me the courtesy of sitting here and watching me goof around and make these silly videos and everything. The least I can do is, you know, let you know what the situation is and all that. Yeah, that's what you're swimming in. Um, although I don't know that I care for your language there, Leon. I don't know how many times we have to have this discussion. Very much running low on space, and that one we need. That one, oh yeah, we need like the the spinning handle. I don't know that I want to fill up my inventory a whole lot more right now. Um, okay, I guess I'll take it for now. We've it, we've got to be getting close. Just thinking about how many places we've been and the amount of stuff we've encountered. Okay, we're about to face something for realsies here. I'm gonna get this sucker ready to go here. Well, I don't know you're there. I know. Hi, kitty. What's the matter, hon? This looks like it's gonna be alive. Yup. Should have known. I should have just shot it. I should have known. I should have just known. That was on me. That was a poor decision on my part. I I acknowledge that. Come on. I don't want to deal with your little your little spermy tadpoles, okay? Oh, for crying out loud. Alright, yeah, and I hear the other voice. I want to deal with this one first, though. Okay, I think that one's been dealt with. Oh, I see, it's just you. Can I take care of you, like, from this side so that I don't have to deal with you later? If I can do that, that would be rad. There we go. Yeah, that way I don't have to deal with you anymore. Whoa, what do we got? Oh, we can get our knife back. Okay, cool. Well, might as well, right? Okay. Yeah, I should have just shot that thing. I bet you I could have gotten, like, a leg up if I got a surprise attack or something. Seems like the kind of mechanic they would have added. The kind of stuff that game makers love. Like, oh, if you get the surprise attack, it's worth, like, 800% damage. Because everyone knows bullets hurt more... Uh, they do more damage when you don't know they're coming as opposed to when you do. Everyone knows. Everyone knows you have a better chance of surviving a bullet if you're looking right at it when it hits you in the head rather than if it hits you in the back of the head. You know, survival tips for you right there. Um, Interesting. But, like, actually, no, that's not a survival tip. Don't get shot. That's that's the real survival tip right there. Don't get shot, ever. 
Like try try to never get shot. It's I'm so far I'm doing a pretty good job of that one myself. I'm gonna try and keep my streak going here, my record going. Um, been overall a positive experience for me, not getting shot. Um, so you know, just there are copies of emails to Umbrella Hook. Uh, Director Owens, there are alarms going off all over Nest. I don't know what's going on, but I can hear gunfire, and I can't reach my section chief. We are trapped. Please send help a sap. Director Owens, the situation here is dire. Nest has been contaminated with the virus. It's unbelievable. Failsafe system didn't activate at all. Is this the work of outsiders? I can't imagine who else it could be, but why? Mayor and Kim are dead. I can't stop coughing. Why won't you answer me? Director Owens, you. It was you all, uh, and then he died. Yes, love. Uh, what he, maybe he died while he was writing it. Well, if he died, he would just say, ah, he wouldn't buy, bother carving it in the wall. Monty Python, anyone? Anyone? Set track with anyone else? Anyway. I think we got some shotgun bullets. Um, back there. Okay. Uh, alrighty. That. There's still stuff to do in the control room here. Ah. Oh, I, I don't think we... Yeah, I don't know if we know the combination for that. I, if, I bet you we could remember it if we... Like, if I remembered what it was uh, from the Claire run-through. Um, but I don't, so... Lack and alas, here we are. Oh, cutscene. Maybe that means we're finally at a save point. I don't like the sound of that. I'm sure it's fine. Don't overreact. Oh no. <laughs> she's in the, she's in she's basically in the Resident Evil version of a Sarlacc pit. Um okay, is there like okay, yeah, there is a safe spot here. Okay, cool, perfect. We're gonna save here and call it a session. Because we're like well beyond that time. Um getting close to not wanting to go any further with our saves, because I don't want to overwrite the clutter saves here. But we'll go ahead and save. Or the final clutter save is the one I don't want to overwrite. So there we go. Cool. So uh, we're going to call it an episode there. Thank you so much to everyone who joined me uh, to, uh, this far. To, uh, love and appreciate all of you. Um, I'm going to stick with my previous previous advice. Uh, don't get shot. Um, you know, it just, like, I, I can't overstate enough how much better it is to be not shot than it is to be shot. Um, like I say, I, I guess I can't really speak from experience um, having someone who's never been shot. Uh, but from what I hear, it's generally unpleasant. So, you know, I'll, I'm willing to take the advice of others. Seems pretty unanimous that it's not a cool thing to have happen. Uh, and we'll just try and avoid having that uh, experience myself. And I recommend it, that you do it as well. Um, good for all of us to, you know, kind of be on the same page with that kind of stuff. So uh, with that advice, uh, we'll, we'll see you next time. Love you. Bye.